just got this uh, Epson Echo Tank ET3850. Let's open the box. Let's open it up. Now I'm done filling the uh, ink tanks. I'm going to start the charging process. is charging. It will be done when the power button stops flashing. What I'm going to do next is to print this test page I find from uh, absence.com uh, and let's see the quality and also the printing speed. I'll hit print. There it goes. It prints pretty fast. The 
quality is pretty good. Um, plain letter size paper. Next, let's make some copies. First, I'm going to use this ADF. See how it goes. Now we're supposed to lay the paper like this, face up, face up, oh, too tight, okay, and the paper is ready to be scanned, let's see how it goes. Now the copy function is selected, I'll just press OK. I'll choose color, one-sided, this button to start the, cop the copy. Okay, the feeder. You can see the difference. Now let's try the flat bed. Flat bed. Open this. This. Go this way. Okay. Now this is the flat bed. This is the ADF. These two copies actually looks very, very close. Maybe the flat bed is slightly better, but I really can't tell. Okay, next we're gonna do some plain text printing. Just copy this from Epson's website. We're gonna try to print this and see how fast it goes. pretty fast I'd say. Now I'm going to do a auto two sides printing using the same plain text file. pretty cool and the quality is good speed is uh, acceptable I'm happy with it so overall I'm happy with this printer and I hope this video is helpful and thanks for watching I'll see you next time